All right, boom. So, who we here with? Eero, E-E-E. How you doing, bro? I'm chilling, I'm chilling. What's good? Excellent, excellent. So, let me ask you, bro. Are you a music fan? For sure, for sure. So, what's been in your rotation lately? Man, everything. I listen to everything. Hip-hop, blues, funk, like everything. I make music, so I need to get inspired. Okay. Feel me? I listen to a lot of music in the daily. It's like my whole, my whole personality is music. Who do you think is the best artist of this generation and why? Of this generation, like 2000. 10 more for me even if he doesn't drop i'm gonna say two if it's all right okay, it's fine, it's fine. even if they don't drop music like that but they put a lot of effort in their music so i i i appreciate that i'm gonna say flaco rocky and i'm gonna say frank ocean for sure what are your thoughts on the current state of hip-hop in this direction i mean it's cool it's kind of a lot of underground like wave going on and so it's cool but i don't really get into it because i kind of like music that good production good shit going on i like sky water even if he's underground and shit he he put a lot of i mean he got good production and shit so he's cool which recent rap album do you think had the most impact and why for me i'm gonna say mr morale because hey. it's like kind of deep and it's like about mental health and shit and i'm kind of like been through a lot of shit and it kind of helped me so uh, i like that album do you think lyrical content in rap has improved or declined over the years oh sh i'm gonna say decline i'm gonna say decline it's not a lot of rappers that really put that much effort into writing and shit like people like catchy music and it's kind of cool but i kind of like i mean storytelling and shit that's what i'm really into like but i seen it i seen it got decreased but i hate that but it's it is what it is how important do you think fashion and style are to a rapper today a lot if you don't put that shit on, I don't know what the fuck is you doing. I, I see a lot of rappers be bugging out, putting Amiri's on and shit. Like, bro, you really gotta have that sense of fashion in you if you're really like, you're an artist, bro. You represent yourself in a good way. That's what I like Flacco and shit. Like, he mixed that shit. If you see his, his last, like, runaway, yep. that shit was, that shit was, like, improving. Like, if you see a rip hop, a hip hop artist doing that shit, that's just inspiring for me and shit. For sure. Yeah, facts. Are there any rappers that are standing out to you right now? Like how? Just in general, anybody new you've heard? Anybody that you've been playing heavy lately? I'm a, uh, ain't gonna lie, I be playing old shit. I don't really listen to like new rappers and shit. But I heard a lot of like the new ones. I'm gonna just say like King Carson and the Opium Gang. I like I like their wave because they bought that shit in and, and everybody followed it. So I'm gonna just say the ones that originally came with that style. It's like Cardi and Lone and Ken all together as new artists. How do you think the portrayal of women in rap has changed over time? Like, uh, what do you mean? How are women artists looked at in today's rap versus back then? I mean, back then, if you see like Lauren Hill, they used to like talk about actual, like actual stuff that they've been going through and they trying to like change it with music. Now it's kind of more of like flexing and who got the biggest fake butt and all that shit. It's kind of got decreased the same as the lyrical shit. I don't like it, but it is what it is. People like that shit. It's just commercial now. One stays, one goes, all right? Drake or Kendrick Lamar? K-Dot, every day of the year, every day of whatever. I must say K-Dot because, bro, like, he actually put effort in his music. Like, Drake makes hits. I listen to Drake, some of his hits. But if you want to listen to a whole album from the start to the finish, it's K-Dot. I listen to albums. I don't listen to singles. Right. So that's what I'm going to go K-Dot. Travis Scott or Playboy Cardi? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. shit. I ain't gonna lie, Travis, Travis is like, he's fire, bro. He's got good albums, everything. But for me, I'm gonna say Cardi, because I'm more connected with Cardi. I'm gonna say Cardi. Future or Young Thug? Uh, young Thug. Slime. All day, free Young Thug. Kanye or Lil Wayne? Uh, fuck. Everybody likes Lil Wayne. Everybody's more into Lil Wayne. But Kanye marked me and is like, bro, he changed my life, bro. Like, okay. for real. Kanye, bro. All day, ye. Favorite Kanye album? Uh, I'm gonna say the beautiful dark twenty, if it, like that. Mm -hmm. and, but if you like, if I really wanna like go deep, I'm gonna say college dropout, cause bro, cause right. oh my god, right. like that shit is so fire, like right. nobody can match that album no more. Favorite Kanye song? Oh shit, I'm gonna say Roses. I'm gonna say oh shit, some shit from the college dropout, cause I listen to a lot of college dropout. I'm gonna say Gold Digger. Okay. I'm gonna say Hey Mama is fire. Uh, bro, I like I'll run away. One of my favorites. 
all day. And the new shit, I'm gonna say his like life of the party with Andre. Yeah, yeah that that song is life changing for yes, sure. That that shit is a lot. X or Juice World? That's yeah. tough. That's <laughs> actually that's fucking tough. that like because I actually love both of them. Juice, I listen to it, like his songs. I know by heart. Yes. Like every song you play, I go. But I'm gonna say X because. X like since I was like fucking 14 he was just my idol I ain't, gonna, I ain't gonna lie bro I feel like everybody in my generation like looked at looked at X like that's really him and it was like sad when he passed away that shit like really mocked me so I'm gonna go X for sure Lil Durk or Meek Mill? Oh Dirk, <laughs> Dirk. I guess that's like everybody in there Lil Baby or Gunna? Shit Baby, I don't fuck with Gunna like that. Lil Uzi or 21 Savage? Uh, Savage. The Weeknd or Party Next Door? The Weeknd. I listen to The Weeknd more than Party Next Door. I feel like girls listen to Party Next Door a lot, but it's like, I don't know. I just listen to The Weeknd because I've been listening to him since like a long time ago when he just started. So yeah, I'm going to go The Weeknd because of I listen to him more. Pop Smoke or A Boogie? Oh shit! Yeah, oh New nah, York shit. New York shit, for sure, bro. Pop Smoke changed drill music. A Boogie is very talented, bro. Every Boogie really raps, bro. Nah, this one is actually tough. This is like toughest one. Shit, I'ma go. I'ma go A Boogie. Okay. I'ma get A Boogie. Any reason specifically? I don't. I just listen to A Boogie more. I don't listen to drill music like that. But I listen to Pop Smoke. Like it's the only drill music that I listen to. Pop Smoke, but Chicago. Like out of the Chicago, it's only Pop Smoke. But I listen to A Boogie more, so I'm going to just go A Boogie. And I got two more for you, bro. Tory Lanez or Brent Fires? Uh, Brent Fires. Brent Fires, because the shorty likes <laughs> I feel like you with the shorty play Brent Fires, you good. And last one for you, bro. Frank Ocean or Tyler the Creator? I ain't going to lie. It's Frank Ocean. Like, like from that's from the top. But Tyler is very talented. He's like one of the few artists that really take this music shit serious, bro. He's so, like, he's one of my inspirations, too. I really looked up to Tyler. He be, he be doing a lot of shit. He got his clothing line going on. He be doing amazing in that. He's very good in production. He does everything. His videos are fire. Tyler's very creative. But for me, Frank Ocean, because his albums kind of, like, touch me more. All right, so let me ask you, bro. It's finally getting nice outside. What is the theme song of the day? The theme song in the, of the day. I'm going to say, I'm going to say Piso. Uh, by Rocky, yeah, I'm the, <laughs> you know, that's the team song of every fashion boy. Like, like, you get me? Everybody that put that shit on, play that shit. Ain't gonna lie, that's every day, all the summer. Anything else you want to say to the people? Nothing really. I had a good time here. <laughs> uh, Eero, it was good talking to Evian. Evian, yeah. it was cool. New York is getting lit. Everybody's getting lit. And music is coming soon. No I be that pretty motherfucker. Harlem's what I'm rapping. Tell my niggas with the bitch and we gon' make it in a second. Never disrespect it. Plus, I'm well connected with this coke that I imported. Just important as your president. Swagger 